Hi guys, welcome back to Lindsay Out Loud where we have fun with stories. Today's book is all about being who you want to be, no matter what people say, because you are awesome. Today we are reading I Am a Tiger. Let's do this. This book is being read with permission from the author and the publisher. I Am a Tiger, written by Carl Newson and illustrated by Ross Collins and published by Scholastic. I am a tiger. No, no you're not. A tiger is much mm. bigger than you are. And it has a bit more grr. Tigers can be small too, grr. Not that small. Uh -uh. And a tiger has stripes. Some do, this one doesn't. So there, I am a tiger. <laughs> Tiger can climb a tree. Can you? I could okay. climb a tree. I could climb to the moon if I wanted to. Really? Most tigers can. I'm a tiger. I love his confidence. Go on then, climb to the moon. I can't just now. It's time for my lunch. A tiger hunts for its lunch. Grr, I'm a tiger. <laughs> no, you're not. You're no. a, a, Chew! I am not in a, a chew. Uh -uh. I am a tiger. <laughs> no, I am a tiger. Oh gosh, okay, we have a real tiger here and everyone is scared. <laughs> You're not a tiger. You're a mouse. What? Huh? Look at your tiny twitchy nose. Look at your little hands and feet. I'll bet you had cheese for breakfast. What? I am a tiger. The tiger's like, huh? I can do this. Can you? How about this? Oh dear. You, sir, are definitely a mouse. And oh I am a tiger. God. If I am a mouse, then what are they? Who are they? Who me? Furry, stripey, funny looking face? <laughs> This is a caterpillar. Long, red, likes to bounce. This is a balloon. Thin, pointy, hangs in trees. This is a banana. What? Tiny, colorful, sits on a stick. This is a lollipop. No! What? Now, I really must be going. My lunch won't catch itself. What a silly old bunch. Everyone is like, what just happened? I'm not sure what's going on. <laughs> Gah, I am not a tiger. How could I be so wrong? Wait a minute. Look at those teeth, those claws, that tail. It's obvious. Mm -hmm. I am a crocodile. Oh, there's the croc. Yikes. The end. I love the way this little guy saw the world. He was so convincing and confident, and that's so important. Good job, you. I believed he was a tiger. Mm. Anyway, that's it for today, guys. If you loved I Am a Tiger, please be sure to grab yourself a copy, and I will put the link to down in the description below. Thank you so much for joining me again, and I will see you next story time. Thanks. Bye.